up guys, my name is Kaylee and I'm the community manager on Overdrive City. And today we're excited to do part two of our Let's Play series where we're gonna be looking at special events. Special events are an opportunity for you to get a limited edition car that you can only get through these events. They last around nine days and each event will have a new car. However, some cars will come back to give you a second chance to get your favorite cars. So let's jump right into it. This event is called the No Mercy event. You're gonna have the opportunity to unlock your very own Lamborghini Murcielago. So when you jump into the race, you're gonna be greeted at the paddock with your test car. This car is for you to use to try to unlock your own Murcielago by unlocking blueprints and gaining tickets to go up the leaderboard. But before you do any of that, you're actually gonna need some gas. Which brings us to our first tip. Manage your city to produce as many tokens possible to get as much gas as you can. Because more gas that you have, the more opportunities you'll have to get all the tickets you need to unlock that Mercy Lago. And even though the car may not be interesting to you this time around, you should still produce as many of those tokens as possible and sell them as a way to make some fast, soft currency. Now, we are going to get the headlights here, so just click produce, you'll wait a 15 minutes, or you can skip ahead if you want, and get that gas needed to do your first race. So let's go in, here is your beautiful Mercy Lago, and let's select the track. You'll have three tracks to choose from with three different difficulties, and each one will actually give you different rewards. So tip number two, check the view details tabs at the bottom of each one. You'll notice that they will give you different rewards. So although hard is the hardest, it won't give you the same rewards. So really prioritize depending on what you're trying to do. Are you trying to increase the PR on your test car? If so, try doing more easy races. Or are you trying to get more tickets? Then do the hard race. But at the end of the day, make sure you check a level that's good for you. You're better at doing a level that you'll get max reward on than doing a level that's not really for you and getting less rewards. So let's race. We're gonna jump into medium mode where we're gonna have the opportunity to race against the boss of this level. What's interesting about the Mercy Lago event is that each difficulty actually has different tracks. So you'll always have an opportunity to test your skill and really refine those corners. They're not always easy. At the end of each race, you'll get a toolbox. These toolbox will give you special event tokens that are used to upgrade that special event car. So this time around, we only got one token, but the better you do on races, the more tokens you'll actually get. So let's go and upgrade this Mercy Lago. We can upgrade the acceleration, and since we already had everything we needed, we can increase to tier three. Now, the advantage of upgrading this car is that it'll make it easier during the other events as you can see on the side here, there are three new things to consider. First is the research points. These research points are specific for the Murcielago, so you can only use them during this event and any other Murcielago events. So although you may have some points left over from this event, you'll be able to use them next time around. The other thing you'll notice are tickets. Now these tickets are used to get checkpoint bonuses. Each bonus will get you either a Murcielago blueprint, some cash, soft currency, and even some expansion items, which are always very useful. The other thing these tickets are used for are the leaderboard. Now, depending on your class on the leaderboard at the end of the event, you'll get some extra goodies, including some Lamborghini Murcielago blueprints, some cash, and a special trophy decoration to put in your city. Now, these tickets are only for this specific event. You won't get them next event, unlike the research points. So do keep that in mind. Which brings me to tip number three. Now, even though you may not finish the event with the Murcielago, make sure to stack up on those research points because they will be back next time around and you'll have another opportunity to get it. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for watching and make sure to let us know what tips and tricks you're looking for in the comments down below. Later, guys.